So as mentioned at the end of my last video, I've decided to make part two of my top 15 Easter eggs in 2019. Now in that last video, I said that 2019 wasn't an amazing year for Easter eggs, but the fact that I've gathered 30 top quality Easter eggs between this and my previous video sort of makes me sound like an idiot. As was the case in that last video, this list contains Easter eggs from games that released this year or had an update to include an Easter egg this year. Before we get started, I'd like to take this chance to introduce you to War Robots. War Robots is an online 6v6 PvP shooter where you take control of giant robots to take down your enemies. The game is free to play on Android and iOS, so you could get started today, but if you want to head start on your fellow warriors, and let's be honest, who wouldn't, you can use my special code in the description, which will give you 100 gold, a massive 400,000 silver, and the gear pad War Robot, which is one of the fastest robots in its class. Of course, of course, clicking the link also helps the channel too, so it's a win-win. War Robots has been downloaded over 90 million times, and it's the huge variety of robots, weapons, skins, maps, and game mods that keep those same people coming back every single day to experiment with new builds and strategies. Even though the game is called War Robots, it's not all about giant chunks of metal going head to head. You also get to choose your pilot, each with their own unique ability to give you the edge on the battlefield. Trust me, it's a lot deeper than your average free-to-play game. So if you have the slightest interest in intense multiplayer games, or are a little strapped for cash due to all the Christmas presents you've bought, then check out War Robots today by clicking the link in the description or in my pinned comment. Not only do you get the gear pad, the 100 gold and the 400,000 silver, you also get to know that you're helping out this channel massively. Once again, thank you to War Robots for sponsoring today's video, and let's get into the Easter eggs. So up first, let's take a look at even more easter eggs from the easter egg juggernaut that is Hitman 2. In the last video, I said that I tried to show some restraint when it came to including too many Hitman 2 easter eggs, but you know what? If a game has great easter eggs, they deserve to be in this video. So let's start by taking a look at a couple of easter eggs added to the excellent Miami map. First up, if you shoot the three Atlantoid water bottles found on the map, a button will appear from the ground. If you press it, this will happen. So this easter egg is actually pretty useful as it takes out your target. Sure, you kill like 15 civilians in the process, but every cloud, right? The second easter egg found on the Miami map is far more creepy. In the convention center, if you take a sniper with you and zoom in on the robot in the window, the writing on the wall will spell out live exorcism in progress, which is not a coincidence. Stir the robot long enough and it will begin to move. When you finally zoom out, you'll probably need to change your underwear. This next easter egg is typical Hitman, as in it's downright crazy. On the Havana Island map, you'll need to collect the 11 Taurus pamphlets. After you've found the 11 pamphlets, you'll then need to head to the villa and make the girl in the pool unconscious. I found a hamburger to be quite useful here. If done correctly, the man on the diving board will jump into the water, and this will happen. So it seems to be a tornado made up of moose. Of course, this isn't the first time we've seen a moose in the Hitman series, as one would fall from the sky on the Marrakesh map in Hitman 2016. The final easter egg takes place on the bank map and turns 47 into something out of a 1940s detective film. To activate it, you'll need to shoot the lights above all of the pictures in this hallway. Well, all of the lights bar this one. After you've shot all the lights, a key will appear around the neck of the painting. 
you'll then need to head down to the safety deposit room and take out the two bankers which will allow you to use the key you found earlier to open the safety deposit box. Inside is a gold idol, take it and place it where I do and hide inside the box. So that does it for the Hitman 2 easter eggs, it's time to check out a couple of easter eggs from the latest in the Far Cry series, Far Cry New Dawn. New Dawn wasn't all that I'd hoped it would be, but it was more Far Cry which is never a bad thing. When it came to easter eggs, Ubisoft was once again up to its old tricks of referencing their other franchises. During the government plane wreck expedition, you could find a crashed government plane. I know, who saw that coming in an expedition named Plane Wreck? Anyway, if you infiltrate the plane and take out the guards patrolling it, you can interact with a laptop. This laptop actually opens a secret door with a rather familiar looking suit. So this is obviously the suit of Sam Fisher from the Splinter Cell series. Use off to drop a couple of references to Sam Fisher in their recent releases, so fingers crossed we get a new entry in the series sometime soon. The next easter egg that a lot of you seem to like from New Dawn was this one that can be heard when Herc is downed. Please, I don't want to go, I'm not ready to go, there's so much I haven't done yet. Oh, Mr. Stark, I don't feel so good. So that was obviously a reference to this scene from Avengers Infinity War. Is it Stark? I don't feel so good. Speaking of Ubisoft games that were pretty much more of the same, February saw the release of The Division 2, and with it some pretty cool easter eggs. The first of which is this. So a backpack webbed to a wall. This is a pretty obvious nod to your friendly neighbourhood Spider-Man. Actually, whilst we're on The Division 2, now would be a good time to round up all of the IT references found in games this year. So starting with The Division 2, you could find this red balloon in the sewers. Moving on to another Ubisoft game, this time Ghost Recon Breakpoint, which also featured a red balloon in a sewer. The next red balloon can, you guessed it, be found in a sewer on the docks map in Call of Duty Modern Warfare. The final red balloon can rather surprisingly be found in Luigi's Mansion 3. Well okay, it's not a red balloon, but it's a balloon in the sewer, what more do you want? Speaking of easter eggs in Modern Warfare, the 2019 reboot wasn't exactly filled with them, but it does have a pretty intriguing discovery to make. On the multiplayer map hill, you can spot something moving in the trees. So the popular opinion, and one that I share, is that this is a reference to the Predator, probably signalling some type of event to come in the future. So this next easter egg is from a game that I've only played to record the easter egg you're about to see. Conan Exiles is a survival game which officially left early access in 2018. The easter egg that we're interested in though was added in an update this year. Neebs Gaming are a YouTube channel who specialise in Battlefield, Subnautica, Ark, Survival Evolved and other similar games. The channel has over 650 million views and were also responsible for creating the excellent Battlefield Friends series. They've actually appeared a couple of times in the Battlefield series but it's their appearance here in Conan Exiles that I find the funniest. Hello? Hey! Is, that, is somebody out there? I hear someone out there. Oh, help! Hey, get us out of here! Help! Listen, listen. We're we're on the other side of the door. We, we're kind of in a pickle. Could use your help. Think there's some levers out there? A good chance one of them will will open the door and we'll be. Could you pull a lever, please? Pull it, please. Just pick a lever. No, bees! No, bees! Bees! Shut the door! Shut the door! Shut the door! Oh, 
I guess I'm, I'm allergic to bees. Oh no! I'm, I'm gonna swallow it up. Oh. Abstro! Oh. Oh, no. Abstro, no! Abstro! Oh. oh, how convenient. He is allergic. He's dead. Pick another lever. Oh wait, I hear something. What's that? What? What is oh, it? What ah, is... darts! Whoa! Oh! No. Oh. 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 Whoa! 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 That was close. <laughs> oh. Holy crap! Damn! Oh. Holy shit. Uh, Thick, you look like a pincushion. Uh, I could they were easy uh, to avoid. Uh, Th Thick? Uh, Thick? Oh, they were clearly poisoned, Simon. It's like they were just aimed at him, because I didn't even move. I, I saw that. Okay, uh, maybe pick another? Yeah. A fire! We're all burnt! Yeah, Ugh. but I'm allergic to fire! What? What, what do you mean allergic to fire? <laughs> oh, oh no. There's Neebs. Alright. Another door's open, okay. Simon. Alright, this is gonna be good. Gotta be it. This is gonna be good. Oh shit. Oh mother damn. Ooh. I'm allergic to tigers. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh, uh, do. Seems to like you, Simon. Oh, Seems show. to like you. <laughs> oh, could you go back away, please? Back away, please, for me. Oh, no. Oh, oh boy. I can't. Oh, I can't. I can't. I can't. Simon. Simon. Oh, God. I wish I could have helped you. But I would have died. Okay. It's just me in here. <laughs> Oh, good kitty, who's a good kitty? Who's a good full kitty? You're not gonna be hungry for a- Hey, thank you so much. No more levers? All right. Uh, thanks anyway, I, I'm good. Cat's full. Yeah. Have a good day. Ooh. Thanks for trying. Up next is an easter egg from the final season of Telltale's The Walking Dead. By now we all know the story of Telltale and how the final season of The Walking Dead was almost left unfinished due to Telltale's financial problems, but Skybound stepped in and ensured the fans of the series got to see the end of Clementine's story. With The Walking Dead games being such depressing and desperate affairs, this easter egg definitely lightens the mood. When in the cave, if you interact with these items in this order, those being crystal, toy and woodpile, the option to look at the stream will appear. To burn. The final easter egg in today's video is from a horror game that already gave us one of the best easter eggs of 2018. Visage is another walking simulator horror experience seemingly inspired by Hideo Kojima's PT. In 2018, the game referenced Silent Hill The Room with this amazing easter egg, and in 2019, it's Doom that gets the Visage reference treatment. So that's it. That is in total 30 of the best video game easter eggs of 2019. If you enjoyed this video then a like is really appreciated. If you're a fan of easter eggs and secrets in games then perhaps consider subscribing as that's what this channel is all about. Thank you all very much for watching and I'll speak to you all soon.